heard by all. 186. People sensitive to motion sickness feel distinct unease and physical discomfort from motion as slight as an elevator or train ride. This means that the thousand mile per hour alleged uniform spin of the earth has no effect on such people, but add an extra 50 miles per hour uniform velocity of a car and their stomach starts turning knots. The idea that motion sickness is nowhere apparent in anyone at a thousand miles per hour, but suddenly comes about at a thousand fifty miles per hour, is ridiculous and proves the earth is not in motion whatsoever. 187. The second law of thermodynamics, otherwise known as the law of entropy, along with the fundamental principles of friction and resistance, determine the impossibility of Earth being a uniformly spinning ball. Over time, the spinning ball Earth would experience measurable amounts of drag, constantly slowing the spin and lengthening the amount of hours per day. As not the slightest such change has ever been observed in all of recorded history, it is absurd to assume the Earth has ever moved an 